Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My brothers and sisters, this Ramadan is unique. This Ramadan is amazing. This Ramadan is a chance in a lifetime. This Ramadan is so different. We never dreamt in our lives that we would have a Ramadan like this. We are going to make the most of this beautiful month of Ramadan. There is no way that we would ever waste our days in the month of Ramadan. There may be restrictions to the masajid, but there is no restriction to congregational prayer in your home, or there is no restriction to prayer. There is no restriction to the Quran and its recitation. There is no restriction at all to ibadah, worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. We never dreamt in our lives that we would have such a Ramadan, unique opportunities that were unheard of this Ramadan Allah has shown us his favor from a different angle altogether we are turning to Allah we appreciate the favors of Allah we appreciate each other we're reaching out to the poor and the needy from the comfort of our own homes by donating online we're asking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's mercy from the place of worship designated in our own houses amazing for the first time we're engaging in acts of worship from our homes in such abundance that we've never used the home for so many acts of worship. Isn't this a blessed Ramadan? My brothers and sisters, we might be under lockdown in some countries, but we're not locked. Shaitan is locked. Subhanallah. We still will obey Allah's instruction. We will recite more Quran. We will engage in more dhikr and the remembrance of Allah. We will learn more online than we ever have in our lives. We must make sure that we fulfill the acts of worship we are supposed to be fulfilling. The iftar will be slightly different, but it will be unique, full of love. We have a chance to shine to our loved ones. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, خيركم, خيركم The best from amongst you, the one he or she who is best to his spouse and family members. This is a lovely opportunity. Here is Allah throwing it in our direction. Subhanallah, make the most of this lovely month. Be kind to your loved ones. Smile at your children, your spouse, your parents, your siblings, whoever you're living with. Make a phone call to those whom you care about. Tell them you love them. Tell them how much you are praying for them and pray for them. Tell them how much you miss them and how, inshallah, when the days are good, we will reunite by the will of Allah. This is going to be a unique month, a month we will talk about for a lifetime, a month that will be spoken about in the future generations. When they look at the history, they will talk about us and how we had a month of Ramadan, a special gift by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, used in a unique way where we were responsible, we did take all precautions, but we unleashed the potential that we have. How much are we going to worship Allah? How many of you are going to memorize portions of the Quran this Ramadan? I hope the answer is yes, I'm included in that list. How many of you are going to be doing more in terms of helping, lending a helping hand in the home, cleaning up, Perhaps a little bit of cooking, perhaps a little bit of some form of goodness within the home. My brothers and sisters, let's not waste our time. This is a unique month of Ramadan, amazing gift of Allah. We will definitely be questioned by Allah how we used his gifts. Don't think it's all negative. The negativity is a small fraction. But the positivity is the overwhelming portion. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala really bless every one of you. I pray that this Ramadan will be the best Ramadan ever. I am planning a lot of goodness and I, play, I pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help me to fulfill that goodness. And I hope that every one of us is planning goodness the most we've ever planned. Execute it for the sake of Allah. It's the month of mercy, the month of forgiveness, the month of freedom from the fire, and we will never waste such a blessed month. Ramadan is still the most blessed month of the year. Laylatul Qadr will still be the most powerful night throughout the year. 
it will be there. It is in Ramadan. It is a gift of Allah. May Allah make us from among those who can witness such a blessed occasion. May Allah accept all of us, grant us forgiveness and grant us entry into paradise without reckoning. Jazakumullah khair. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.